All right, people. So it is March 24th, 2020 in the Big Bear Lake area. This is basically after all these little storms are done. We got a little disturbance coming in in a few days, but it's not gonna be anything just like this. So guys, yeah, like all that huge amount of snow we were supposed to get through all these multiple storms didn't happen. But we're just gonna do a quick drive around the lake because I know a lot of you like these lake drives. So you guys can get a sense of what town looks like right after the snow. Even though none of you can come up here, I guess, like, um, unbelievable, man. Everyone's locked down and the economy is getting hurt right now. And all because the media and people hate one man who looks orange. I mean, it's, it's just, it's just mind boggling. Um, there have been hundreds of thousands of cases of coronavirus that haven't even been addressed and the people have recovered and stuff like it's it's just uh it's just fear mongering but it is what it is i just hope you people are smart enough to figure it out but then again that's my opinion so it's uh we all have opinions everyone you know a-holes are like opinions everyone's got one but no opinions are like a-holes everyone's got one okay anyway so you know what? We're not going to just do the small drive. We're going to go all the way around to Baldwin because I want you guys to see the, the Big Bear snow rule. There's nothing out there. It looks like just straight up desert out that way. And you guys are about to see that in a little bit. Hang on guys. a second. So here's like we're at the Big Bear Dam area basically. snow over there then when we get over here where the sun hits the snow has melted pretty quickly you know what if we get all the way over to a like division road and we don't see any more snow then there's no point in going all the way to Baldwin <laughs> are you guys sorry I didn't get that turned on <laughs> right away but we're on the other side of the lake we just turned on the big bear dam and uh yeah just wanted you guys to see how beautiful it looks today look at those clouds just rolling over snow summit that's so beautiful i love that but otherwise it's one of the most beautiful days i've seen up here in a long time temperature is 44 and uh the skies are as blue as can be for me sweet dude thank you wow man it is so crystal clear out here today everything just looks so beautiful Alright guys, we might not need to go all the way to Baldwin because look at how little snow we have over here.
check this out for a second, this little area. This little spot's pretty nice. I want to rent this place, you guys. Right here. There's nothing for snow. Over here, because it doesn't see much sun, we'll see some snow for sure on the left, but on the right-hand side, good luck. Except for some of those little shady spots right there, you see a little patch. skin right now speed limit's 25 so never forget that in here because uh police up here have nothing better to do <laughs> except generate income for our our area by making people's lives worse taking their money that they already don't have the po thieves police just kidding you know i have a lot of respect for cops to tell you the truth a lot of respect for cops um, I just get frustrated sometimes. So, fun skin, folks. Wow, look at San Gorgonio out there. Looks so beautiful. Fun skin gets great views of San Gorgonio. Right in between those clouds right there. It's beautiful. Yeah, we're not even gonna need to go to Baldwin, guys. You're gonna see there's just no snow. After that foot of snow we were supposed to get, and then the storm before that, five inches. Woo! driving like a champ. I love it. Just nothing over here, you guys. In terms of snow. so clear today man this is incredible we got some clouds rolling in the dam over there
so blue. Yeah, no need to go to Baldwin, you guys, because you get the point. If it's like this here, because I was just at Baldwin, I pro <laughs> promise you guys, dude, it just looks like you're in the desert out there. There's no, there's no snow anywhere. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Oh, come on, dude. I mean, this guy's actually driving pretty well for being in a big truck, so I'm not going to complain too much. guys on his motorcycle I need to get on my bike today oh hello dying just kidding I'm just kidding man dude watch out buddy it's called a street you know what I'm gonna pull over right here and block these guys for a minute bicycle riders come on now so this is Stanfield cut off you guys And over there is the Baldwin area. If you guys can see, there's just there's just nothing over there. There's nothing, not even in the hills, nothing. So it's not necessary for us to go there. So anyway, peace out. Peace out, Stanfield. Cut off. Sucks no one can ski right now, but <sighs> hey, I hate someone so much. Let's just destroy the country because we hate him. Unbelievable. It's such a joke, man. All you guys could be up here having a good time. And infusing money into our economy. 
which is what we need tremendously here. We need it desperately. But it is what it is. I'm not going to get political. It's just I think this is all BS. Shit, I think I had the coronavirus, man. A month and a half ago to a month. It was like the first kind of flu feeling I had where I was really short of breath. I couldn't taste taste my food or nothing like that. It all tasted like paper. And reading a lot about COVID-19 or whatever the hell it's called, um, those were some of the biggest symptoms. So I was like, whoa. But just like a regular flu, I recovered. Just like the regular flu, a lot of people die every year. A lot of people recover. Um, be willing to bet you a million bucks if it was like Obama in office, none of this would be going on. But they hate someone so fucking much. Anyway, I love you guys. I'm done with the politics. I swear. I swear I will not talk politics anymore. I hate politics. But uh, I just want you guys to see how beautiful the town looks right now. I mean, yeah, there's no snow, but it's just gorgeous. Just gorgeous. Peace out, guys. Love you all.